If you've gone through an IVF cycle that didn't result in a pregnancy, I know it can be an incredibly emotional and frustrating experience. But, I want to reassure you, IVF failure is not the end of the road. Many couples face setbacks in their IVF journey, and the good news is, there are steps you can take to improve your chances for future success. First, let's acknowledge that IVF failure can happen for a variety of reasons, and it's important to approach the situation with a calm and patient mindset. Just because one cycle didn't work doesn't mean the treatment won't be successful in the future. Many couples need more than one IVF cycle to achieve their goal of parenthood. So, why do IVF cycles fail? Let's break it down. One of the most common reasons for IVF failure is poor quality embryos. This could be due to several factors, with maternal age being one of the main contributors. As women age, egg quality tends to decline, which in turn affects the quality of the embryos. Older eggs are more likely to have chromosomal abnormalities, which can prevent successful implantation. If you've experienced a failed IVF cycle and suspect egg quality could be a factor, using donor eggs is an option that can improve your chances. Donor eggs from a younger woman typically have a higher quality, leading to better embryo development and a higher likelihood of pregnancy. We can also consider using advanced techniques like pre-implantation genetic testing, PGT, to screen embryos for genetic issues before transferring them into the uterus. Another reason for IVF failure can be implantation issues. Even with good quality embryos, the embryo may not implant in the uterine lining. This could be due to a thin or otherwise unhealthy uterine lining, or it could be related to underlying conditions like endometriosis or fibroids. In these cases, there are treatments that can improve the chances of successful implantation, such as using medications to thicken the uterine lining or addressing underlying conditions. Besides these physical factors, there are other external factors that can affect IVF success. Lifestyle choices such as smoking, excessive alcohol consumption, or being overweight can reduce the chances of a successful pregnancy. Taking care of your overall health before, during, and after IVF treatment is essential. A balanced diet, regular exercise, and avoiding harmful habits can all help improve your chances of success in future cycles. Another key aspect to consider is the IVF treatment plan itself. If you've experienced a failed cycle, it's important to sit down with your fertility specialist to review what happened and why the cycle may not have worked. Sometimes, adjusting the medication protocol, changing the stimulation methods, or trying a different embryo transfer technique can make all the difference. It's also important to acknowledge that the emotional toll of IVF failure can be overwhelming. Dealing with the disappointment, anxiety, and stress is part of the process, but it's important not to lose hope. Many patients have faced IVF failure only to go on and have successful pregnancies after adjusting their approach. Seeking support from loved ones, or even from a counselor, can help you navigate these emotions. One thing that I always stress to my patients is that persistence is key. IVF may take time, and while it's easy to feel discouraged, success is still within reach. It's all about making informed decisions, learning from each cycle, and working closely with your fertility team to identify areas of improvement. So, what should you do next after a failed IVF cycle? First, schedule a thorough consultation with your fertility doctor. Review the cycle, ask questions, and understand the reasons behind the failure. Together, you can create a personalized plan for your next steps, whether it's adjusting your treatment protocol, using donor eggs, or exploring other fertility treatments. And don't forget, every IVF journey is unique. Even though it's difficult, IVF failure can be a stepping stone to success. By learning from each experience, you can increase your chances of achieving the pregnancy you've been dreaming of. Remember, you're not alone in this process. Many couples face setbacks, but that doesn't mean your dreams of becoming parents are over. Stay positive, stay informed, and don't hesitate to reach out if you have questions. We're here to support you every step of the way. Thank you for watching. If you need personalized advice or more information about IVF and how to improve your chances, feel free to reach out. We're always here to help guide you on your journey to parenthood. Don't hesitate to reach out if you have questions. We're here to support you every...